Here we have the SanDisk Ultra, 256 gigabyte with a USB-C connector on this end. And over on this end, we have a USB type A connector. We're going to configure this for the Mac environment and go ahead and install it and format it. So let's go ahead and put in Command Shift and then put in Disk Utility. When this comes up, we want to select the drive and we can select Erase Here or we can right click and select Erase Here. Now, the scheme is the master boot record. So let's go back and change that to GUID partition. Leave the name at SD256 gigabytes and then here APFS comes up. And at this point, we can erase that. That process took just under two minutes. So click done and we're out of it. Now we have an SSD that's formatted to APFS. Here we have the sand disk and an iPhone 15 ready to go. So we flip that down and the USB-C side fits right in here. There it is, it's connected. So we can go to files, tap that, and browse, and we see here the SD256G that we had formatted earlier. So if we select that, we can see that this is empty. So at this point, we can move data to our drive from our phone. Select that. Let's go back to camera. And we'll take this file that we made a while ago share move down so we'll go save to files select browse and sd256 and save and the file's been copied over let's confirm that by going to files and now we have the video this is a copy it doesn't remove your file from your phone so let's go back and look at that we'll go back to photos and the file is still there. However, this is an easy way for us to move files off. And then we can hit the delete button here and delete the video and save space. Hope that helps. Thanks for watching.